When I was by myself again and calm, I sought to remember the time I blacked out. Somewhere between staring at Princess Leia and standing over the lady and her onions and pots and pans. And though I could not catch the time specific, I was able to recall a process whereby I had drawn the tea out of her. The thread of the story was all up in the taking, you see. I could follow it. Inside the pull, I found out about the lady and all her life, savoring the roots of her fear. I knew when she was a little girl, she had been scared of monsters and all sorts of things that never really existed other than in her imagination, which was pretty vivid for an ordinary. Are they all like that? I could contrast this with the time Black pulled me up out of that trap beneath his floorboards and I was on the other end of the stick, being tugged upon how he wanted to rob me of my thoughts and feelings and spirit. But he was not rooting around for fear like I was with the woman, and he wouldn't have found any anyway, not in me. He went straight for the jugular. I guess that was the difference. The malified, he wanted your heart. He wanted your memories, maybe your soul. Whereas we were only trying to take something from you that you might otherwise not want or need anyway. Did you need the tea to survive? Were you so rooted in fear you could not go on without it? I did not know yet know the answers to these questions, but I had plenty to mull over to keep me preoccupied in the wake of my actions. All I knew was I could not now live without the tangy energetic.